Well, you know, I uh, I use the serenity prayer a heck of a lot. Because, you know, the first part of that says, uh, uh, give us the serenity to accept what we cannot change. And there's very little we can change in this world except the way we think about things. And I have to remind myself of that. I can't change this. If, if I could, I could get rich, right? Here's the magic potion. But that, that, that doesn't work out that way. So with the coronavirus, and they see pictures that uh, uh, people standing outside windows talking to their family, and they can't get in and touch them and feel them. Um, they say, I'm, I'm not going to do that. But on the other hand, if you're here, you're actually safer than, than out in, in the real world. I just think if, if you're to the point where you're going to need a facility like this, may as well do it and not wait. Because we don't know when this whole thing's going to end. Actually, we people in independent living have it pretty nice. Some of the ladies always tell me I have to be back when the uh, lights come on, the street lights. And uh, I don't do that. But anyway, so. Uh, 